So here you can see the response of the X, Y and Z. So the Z is a little bit flickery because the area is changing a lot. So if we go back, you can see it goes up. If we go closer, you can see it goes further. And then we can go left and right. You can see the X axis moving up and down. There you go. This is for the left and right. And then if we check the Y, if I go up, it goes up. If I go down, it goes down again like this. So this is the PID controller for that. And then for the last one for the Z, again, if we go back, um, it goes up. If we go come closer, it goes down again. You can see the response. So this is basically the idea of our PID controller. So we are running all three of them at the same time. And now all we have to do is we have to take these PID values and we have to send it directly to our drone, all three of them at the same time. And it should do all the calculation for us to follow the person or to follow the face properly.